What's up everyone, Dabblade here with a Hunter's Guide to Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. In this video, we're going to be demonstrating and explaining what the Buddy Recon system is in the game. So let's dive into this. Now Buddy Recon is almost like a mini fast travel system. They kind of act like fast travel points where you can teleport and get around the map more quickly. But they first have to be discovered out in the field and then established and set up back in Elgado. Now each map has two Buddy Recon points that can be found. Some of you who have played Monster Hunter Rise will already have some of the Buddy Recon points set up and established. But I'll be showing off where all the buddy points are later. Anyway, to set up a buddy recon point, you need to first go to the buddy plaza, whether that's in an Elgado or back in Kimura, and then go into the Meow scenarios. After which, scroll down to buddy recon, and then you'll have the buddy recon menu. Here, you'll be able to select from the various maps that you have buddy recon points unlocked in. Afterwards, you can select one of the two points that you've unlocked. Each map has only two points available and you can only select one. And then you can select a buddy to be assigned to that recon point. So this basically enables you to set up an additional fast travel point on the map. This can be great for speedrunners, for example, or traverse into areas that are difficult to get to. But there is some caveats. For example, it costs 100 Kimura points to actually fast travel to the buddy recon points whilst you're out on a hunt and on top of that these fast travel points can only be used once per hunt as well so make sure you use them when you really need to but that explains what the buddy recon system is all about let's quickly go over how you unlock them well like i said there are various points on the maps that these buddy recon points can be set up you know where these points are by the feline chief Kogarashi commenting on your location and there'll be a shiny glowy point to which you can set up a little Paw print sign indicating that you've set up a buddy recon point. Afterwards, they'll be unlocked for you back at Kimura or Elgado. But where are they? Well, first of all, in the Shrine Ruins. There are two located in the Shrine Ruins. One of them is atop the mountain, found in Zone 5, a very useful place. And the other is towards Zone 13, which is useful for when it comes to speedrunning tougher monsters in the Shrine Ruins. For the Frost Islands, there are two. The first one is found located between zones 7 and 5, and the other is located towards the north of zone 9. Now this recon point is quite difficult to get to because unfortunately it's tucked away all the way up in the mountainside. I personally got there using wire bugs, as is displayed in this footage here. I've also sped up the footage as it's quite a little bit of a trek to actually get here. This is probably the most difficult out of the buddy recon points to unlock unfortunately. But once you're up there, you'll have yourself the final point in the Frost Islands. Next up is the Sandy Plains and there are two here. One of them is located between zones 6 and 5. This is atop a little mountain, but it is quite close to the third sub camp so it's not the most useful. And then you also have one in zone 12 all the way at the north of the map. For the flooded forest, again, there are two of them. The first is found just south of zone 12, up on the cliffside, atop a little temple. This is great for when monsters start in zone 13. And the other is located just north of zone 2, towards the giant pyramid. This is a very useful point because it's one of the furthest points away from the two subcamps we have in this map. When it comes to the lava caverns, again, there are two of them. The first is set up underground between zone 12 and 13. This one can be considered quite difficult to get to in all honesty, as it's tucked away, like I said, underground. And the other is found to the southeast of zone 8, tucked away in a little fishing spot. But next up on the new maps, first of all is the jungle. The first buddy recon point can be found just north of zone 2, on that little hilly cliffside that overlooks zones 2, 9 and 3, great for when monsters start in zone 3 or towards zone 10. And the other recon point is found atop zone 7, on the cliffside again, which is useful for when monsters start in zone 4. And then finally for the Citadel, again there are two buddy recon points. The first is found between zones 10 and 5. This is found again on the hilly cliffsides, it's quite easy to locate. And the other one is high up in the mountains between zones 8 and 6. Now both of these buddy points are great because the two sub camps are quite a distance away from them so it makes getting around the map a little bit quicker especially if you're not worried about spirit birds. But those are all the buddy recon points in the game. Hopefully you'll find this useful and until next time I've been Dabley bringing you a quick hunter's guide to the buddy recon system in Monster Hunter Rise Sunbreak. Hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, subscribe and like for more.